New video tonight from the Upper East Side. You are watching the moment two gunmen hopped out of an SUV and confronted people dining outside. Police say one man was robbed, another was shot while out for dinner at a high-end restaurant. News 4's Miles Miller spoke to the victim's mother and joins us live from the Upper East Side. Miles, first of all, how is that victim doing right now? Oh, he is out of surgery tonight, but his mother said he is just beside himself that he was shot outside of his favorite restaurant. Gunfire at Philippe Chow, a high-end Upper East Side restaurant, sending diners and people on the street running for cover. A 28-year-old plumber from the Bronx hit in the leg. People running afraid and running for his safety. Police say the gunfire was part of a botched robbery. They remove a Rolex watch from one of the victims. A struggle with the second victim ensues. A shot is fired and our victim is struck in the left leg. NYPD Chief of Detectives James Essig says the two robbers jumped out of an SUV, eyeing couples dining outside. That's when two plastic surgery fellows, doctors very early in their career, rushed to save his life. We, we applied some pressure. We got a tourniquet out of a belt that one of the, one of the other patrons gave us. Um, we found, you know, entry and exit wound on the patient, held direct pressure, and then the police were here within a few minutes, which was great. The ambulance was here shortly after. They had a tourniquet with them, the police did. So we applied a couple tourniquets on his, on his thigh. The men took off in a waiting SUV. Police recovered a gun as part of their investigation. One thing prevented more people from getting hurt. A, a black 9mm handgun with a shell casing lodged in the slide was recovered. Thankfully, uh, it was unable to be fired after that first round or else other innocent people could have been injured. The other couple that had the Rolex watch stolen declined to be interviewed. Neighbors here were shocked to hear about this shooting at this Tony restaurant. I don't feel safe anywhere anymore in the city. I'm definitely, you know, very concerned now. Detectives waiting for ballistics to come back on that gun they recovered to see if there are any fingerprints on that shell casing. As for this investigation, police are looking at surveillance video. We expect to have that by 11 o'clock when we see you then. That's the latest live on the Upper East Side. I'm Miles Miller, News 4 New York. Thank you, Miles.